Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpool Gaming and another Skull and Bones video. Today, I'm going to show you how you can form the ghost ship, the Magdalene, so you can get out to all of those amazing cosmetics and even a blue specter as well. Two different methods. I'm going to show you how to do it right here, right now. Let's go! Once again, thanks for watching everybody. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. Now, of course, you know you can come over to the Abaletti and over here you can pick up your daily quest. But what if you finish your daily quest? How do you form the ghost ship? Well, there's two different ways that I've been going about doing it. I'm gonna show you right here, right now. Now I'm gonna mark the location where the ghost ship can spawn up. All you have to do is come over here when it's at night. And you know it's nighttime when you have your lantern out and then just set sail. Turn to the right. And if you see anybody fighting the ghost ship, well, here's your chance to go over here and help them out. And you can get yourself some amazing drops just like you see right here. So even after you finish your quest, you can come over here whenever it turns nighttime and have a look, see if there's anybody over here fighting the ghost ship. Now there is another way that you can form him and do this very efficiently. Now remember the way the world works inside of Skull and Bones is every 30 minutes we have a cycle from daytime then to nighttime, okay? And we're gonna be forming this guy in a specific location. And by the way, this can work for the sea monster as well so it's not just for the ghost ship and there is a specific location where they can spawn in at now over here in the east indies over here by the eastern gulf see i'm gonna mark this location it's right over here by one of the trading routes and also next to where the op willing event can spawn in at okay now over here in this location will be a ghost ship every 30 minutes like legit if you didn't know, that is how everybody is pretty much forming this ghost ship, just like you see all of these guys right back here. So set sail in this location as soon as it hit nighttime. You might even have some people fighting them, but make your way over there and the ghost ship will spawn in every 30 minutes. Remember, that's how the world works. Every 30 minutes it goes from daytime to nighttime. So just wait till nighttime and make your way over here. And uh, yeah, the ghost ship will spawn in as you're about to see it. You can actually see it like from way over here in this distance, but we're gonna make our way over here to the ghost ship so you can see it's not too far from where I marked it at. Okay, so yeah, just follow where that marker is and right around this area in this location will be the Magdalene, the ghost ship. And remember, you can get some pretty freaking amazing stuff. Even the Blue Spectre, I haven't got the Blue Spectre just yet, but when I do, I'll let you know. Now, I have the most success from getting items when I board the ship, all right? So every time I board the ship and I opened up the chest, I was getting some good items. When I didn't do it, I would get some mats, but other than that, you know, I really didn't get no good stuff. I know it's all RNG, but I just wanted to just throw that out there. So boom, there you have it, my dude. Two different ways you can form the Magdalene, the ghost ship, right here in Skull and Bones. But for right now, that's pretty much going to for the video. I hope you truly enjoyed it. Now, as always, if you're new to the channel, how you doing it? Welcome, don't forget to subscribe because right here at Carpool Gaming, we upload a wide variety of videos ranging from updates, tips and tricks, guys and news, and a whole lot more. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.